in the hip. Uh, we can talk about Russian, Russian position right now. This uh, the uh, war. Uh, back and forth, back and forth, uh, that many people died, it's many civilian people died. Uh, it's, uh, it's horrible, uh, especially for civilian uh, women, children, our soldier. Uh, and uh, Russians explain they came to change the government because the government is bad. I'm sorry, every Ukrainian support the decision to be the part of European family is a main priority for us. And uh, Putin not agree with that. Uh, we don't want to live uh, in Russia empire. Uh, it's the main reason why is Russian soldiers coming here. Every Ukrainian support the, uh, uh, this war. Z uh, this war against the Russians because we are not aggressive was to anyone. But if some uh, army come to us, we will be fight. We, we fight for our independence, for our family, for our future, for our values. It's main, its main point. Mm -hmm. and, and can you give me a sense of how far away the Russians are now from, from the center of the... The Russians, the Russians army stay in the board of Kiev, and uh, we, uh, it's not so far, it's uh, from here, I guess, it's uh, 20 kilometers, maybe less. Okay, and uh, how prepared is Kiev to deal with uh, invasion of Russian troops? Uh, actually, it's what did Russians, they destroyed the economy of, uh, uh, of our country. I expect well, I right now the huge humanitarian the catastrophe in uh, uh, in our country. Huge humanitarian catastrophe because uh, our economy destroyed, our infrastructure is destroyed. The people doesn't have a job, people doesn't have money, uh, people doesn't have homes right now. They, millions of people move from his uh, houses and what they do it, they destroy the country. And uh, one, uh, one point, the life of the uh, millions of the people uh, for our independence already paid thousand Ukrainians with his uh, huge price, his life. But uh, what, what is the next? What is the next? Russians uh, have just expectation of rebuild empire. We don't want to Russian Empire. We want to fight for our independence. Is the main message. Um, we were just told that the head of the Russian delegation is waiting for a Ukrainian delegation to come to Gorman. Uh, can you confirm this? Uh, I have information. I, are you able to comment on this? Uh, I have information, but uh, I'm not involved uh, to make a negotiation. I uh, which negotiation? It's, uh, it's, it's no. I, I, I the question. What, which negotiations is one priority? Move away from our country. Mm -hmm. But you can't comment on whether a Ukrainian delegation is coming to Gorman right now. No. no. Okay. Um, and uh, can you, are you able to comment on, on what the fighting has been like in, within Kiev? Because for us reporting on it, it's been really hard to follow and to know exactly what's going on. Sometimes there's reports of shooting in Podil and then on the outskirts of Kiev. Can you give us a sense of what's been uh, happening? The Russians sent some troops, small troops, uh, which actually with uh, some time uh, we, as civilian, with the weapons, snipers and uh, shootings uh, everywhere and uh, they want to make terror attack and uh, to bring the, uh, the panic to our city. Uh, it's a goal, it's a goal. We are uh, hunting uh, of them and we uh, take this, uh, some people, Russians, who are coming to our city. And how, uh, yesterday there were reports that the Ukrainian forces were seeking out these, these Russians within Kiev. How successful has that operation been? Uh, I'm sorry, I don't understand your question exactly. So yesterday there were reports that um, the Ukrainian forces were looking for groups of uh, separate Russian forces within the city. 
Um, how successful has that, that operation been? It's, it's, it's a group uh, make intervention. Right. Yeah. It, it's um, uh, some successful, but uh, they hunting, they, they sit somewhere in snipers right now. We uh, uh, make right now uh, announcement. Nobody allowed to go from houses. First of all, we care about the life of the people from one point, from another point. We try to hunting this, this, uh, this people. It's much more, it will be much more easy if uh, nobody in the street. Okay, so but you can't comment on, on how successful it was last night. Did were you able to 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 find these groups? Uh, what what exactly happened last uh, night? We uh, we kill uh, some people. I, I I guess six people in uh, last night. Okay. Um, how so? You just said that the the Russian forces are roughly twenty kilometers away from the center of Kiev. How long do you think that you can actually hold off the Russian army? So long how we can. Okay. We will be fight so long how we can. So that you're, uh, the resistance of, of, of Ukrainians, would you be able to... Uh, I, I listen about the plans. In two days the Russians have to be here. It's not happens. You know why? Because we have will. We have a good character. Because we fight for our uh, houses, for our country. We in the home. And uh, big demoralization by Russian forces, by Russian soldiers, because they understand they they feel in our country very uncomfortable. Because every Ukrainian had Russians, headed Russians, and the message: go back to home from our country, away, soon as possible. Um, you, there has been a decision to hand out weapons to. Ukrainians who want to defend the city and who want to defend the country. We've seen long lines of uh, young men. It's civilian defense. Right. Civilian defense. There's many people ready to fight for our country and to they asking for the weapons. And that's why uh, many of them people have uh, military background. And that's why we built right now civilian defense. And every uh, uh, every uh, citizens, man or woman, who proud of the country can take the weapons and defend our houses, our families, our children. But is this, how controlled is this? Do you know who is actually getting these weapons? Is there a... a we doesn't, well, to be honest, we doesn't have a 100% control, but uh, we, because we build this uh, uh, territorial defense in very you know, short period of time, but it's patriotics. These people is patriotic. We make a group and study them immediately. And, and what happens if these weapons get into the wrong hands? Let's say criminals or 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 people who are maybe against the. You system. know what? Right now, uh, the question much more important to defend our country. 